the schools in Orleans Parish are some of the most challenged facilities I've ever seen in my life. In fact, I would say they're the worst facilities in America today. It's the foundation of a free society. I mean, if children don't have an opportunity to uh, develop their their minds, their creativity, there's no hope for a decent functioning society. I just guess I like go to the Marines because I got accomplish some of the things that I won't accomplish before I, before I just give up. My two children who are in Bien Bienville, they have 35 kids in their class and they have 15 books. Congressman Jefferson's brother came into the district and told employees that they had to give him some insurance business because Elanice and his brother, the congressman, had worked it out. Look at her daddy, Ken Carter, and, and check his history out. And you'll know that the contracts are going to start flowing. Just, all you got to do is follow the money. That's all. And it'll tell the whole story. Is there any way I can get a commitment from the school board members that we're going to make sure that every child at Bienville has yeah. books? It's a leap test, you know. Once again, you know, it's the last fight. To me, is it? You know? Mario, he, he's scared. Like he think he, he don't know if he want to pay. He don't, he think, he don't think he gonna pass. Him. I want books for my kids, and I don't understand how you can spend money on anything, police, anything. There's no school without books. I don't know what happened. What do you, what do you, what do you get your your inspiration from? You look at your mama and your father. They're fucked up. You look at this teacher who's telling you to go to school and they're in a fucked up Hyundai. You know, so where did all that education get you? In some portions of Africa, when they greet you, they don't ask you how you're doing. They say, how are the children? Because if they know that the children are okay, then you must be okay also.